Hey peeps and welcome to a brand new episode of a game called Brogue. So Brogue is a roguelike that is a little less well known um, and it's one that I stumbled upon and played around with a little bit and was really enjoying so I thought we would go ahead and play it. So let's just jump right in. And also um, the music that's going to be playing during, during the um, during the video is music that I've added. The game doesn't actually have any music. So it's a very old school roguelike. Um, so as you can see, I'm, I, if you download this directly, I'll put a link in the description below. It's a free game you, um, where you can download, download it. Words are hard, guys. I went ahead and downloaded it from uh, the Tiles version, which comes with this prettier look. It's not um, an ASCII, um, an ASCII uh, look. Uh, and I just did that for the channel just so it looks a little bit nicer for you guys. So anyways, to start, uh, the goal is to retrieve the amulet of Yandor for the 26th floor and then come back all the way back up and escape with it. So first thing we do is we find some incendiary darts. Now this, you can move with the ASWD keys, etc. Um, or I can just, I like just using the mouse. That's just what I've been using. So um, we just want to take a look around. We want to thoroughly explore. Um, if I, I'm not like an expert at this game, but I've played enough of it to know that I want to thoroughly explore the dungeon in order to, because um, you don't level up. The, the way that you level up is by gaining more gears and stuff. So the further down you go, the better gear you get, so forth and so on. Also, I apologize, my voice is a little rough. I just, um, I'm trying to take breaks between recordings, but um, I'm trying to get them just whipped out today. So I probably sound a little tired and a little rough voiced. I'm just gonna explore this whole room here. Now I am finding like, oh, here we go, a jackal. So if you mouse over it, it will give you um, all of this information. Uh, it moves quickly, which means it can move two tiles to R1. Um, and we have a 100% chance to hit the jackal, so we we already killed it, one shot at it, which is a good thing. Okay, so let's go ahead and move. There's the staircase to go down, but I want to keep exploring. Oh, a silver wand. I haven't used a wand yet in the game, so that's new to me. I do want to explore a little bit more thoroughly because we don't want to miss any potential weapons. I We see a rat. I don't, oh, all the way over there, we're fine. Not worried about the rat. We can swim across this water, but we'll, it'll um, the current will take things out of our inventory, so we don't want to swim across the water. Uh, ooh. Let's go get that wand. We're gonna do that, because I know that there's nothing there. Here, I'm not as sure. Oh, there we go. There's a rat. Let's go ahead and try to kill that. I mean, there's no reason to kill it, but except for that I want to. We hit the rat, the rat missed us, he had scratched us, we defeated the rat. What's in here? Nothing. Alright, so let's go up here. Oop, oh, there's another rat. I'm just gonna kind of, oh, he came after us. We hit the rat, the rat bites us, we defeated the rat. Cool. We can go through that door, let's do that on the way back. Moving a little bit more slow. ah, here we go. A kobold. And uh, the monkey is being held captive. I think we can release the monkey and um, tame it. Okay, let's see if we can grab this potion. So with the potions, you don't know what they are until you, th you use them. So we're going to not apply it. So we're gonna try throwing this black potion at the kobold and nothing happened. So let's see if we can throw the cyan potion Nothing happens. So those are ones that we want to drink. Okay, so we hit the kobold, the kobold misses us, we hit it, he misses, we defeat it. So let's go, let's go over here. And how do we, shackled in place. I don't want to hit it. Let's grab the wand. You can make it your friend. Free the captive monkey, yes. 
You free the grateful monkey and gain a faithful ally. Sweet, we've got a monkey on our side that's gonna follow us around and help us defeat things, which is awesome. This is why you wanna explore each level pretty thoroughly. So there's another jackal. So it moves faster than us, so we gotta be careful. Is it sleeping? It is sleeping. It's standing now. I'm gonna back up and let it come to us. He missed us, we hit him, we hit him, we defeat him. There's a potion over there that we'll grab. Just wanna look through here. It's our monkey. We hit the rat, the rat misses us, we defeat the rat. Yay, okay. So let's go grab this last potion. And then I think we have officially explored all of the map that we are going to be able to explore. Oh wait, that's not true. Oh, there's a rat there. We defeat the rat was not paying very good attention, was I? There's a little bit over here that we want to check out. Yeah, nothing in there. And nothing in there. So let's head all the way back down here with our new ally, the monkey. Um, okay. Down we go. Ooh, these are good. These will restore our health. So we don't want to use those yet because we don't really have a reason to. There's a kobold down there. Let's peek. Let's just go after the kobold first. He's sleeping. We dispatched it in its sleep. Nice. Let's see if there's anything good in here. There is a potion. An indigo potion. So we don't know what that one does yet. Oh, here's another kobold. He's running from us. Oh, here he comes. We hit him, he clubs us, we hit him, we defeat him. Pretty simple and straightforward. Nothing much in there. But I see something over here know what it is. Rat is sleeping. Rat woke up. Nope, he's still sleeping. We dispatch the rat in his sleep. A willow staff. Cool, what is this? A confusion trap, so we don't want to step in that. So this is a chasm, so this is a big hole. We don't obviously want to go in that. Oh, there's the exit to the next level. Our monkey dude. Trying to explore as much. Ooh, a key. Door key. The notches on this ancient key are well worn. So I don't know as much about this game. I've played it just enough that like I knew I could be moderately successful. Cage won't buzz. Pressure plate and a hole, so we could throw something onto that pressure plate. Um, last time I threw some worn leather armor on there, but let's try throwing a dart. Pressure plate clicks underneath the dart. Cage lists off the altar. We now have a door key. Another scroll. Now, of course, we can't get that back, but that's okay. I feel like it was worth it. Okay, here comes a jackal, so we're gonna wait here. Claws us, we hit him, we defeat him. Where did our monkey go? Oh, he's right behind us. There's some gold up here. Oh, a rat. Cobalt wand. So let's... Just curious what happens if we use so a wand must be a wand of polymorphism. Mmm. We don't okay, so we turned the rat into a bloat. Which we did not want to do. Oh, we fell through. Okay. 
We are damaged by the fall. So we can rest to regain health. Oh, there's a rat. We hit the rat, we defeat the rat. Okay, so if we rest over time, we should gain, let's go help our monkey. Dead rat, health. Why are we not gaining health? Yeah, there we go. So we're gonna rest here for a little bit, gain our health back, go, there's a jackal. We defeated the jackal. Did the jackal kill our monkey? No. Our monkey's still here. Okay, so I want to keep resting. Resting, resting, resting. Oh, there's a the jackal. Thankfully, he kept missing you. So you really have to pay attention to this game, which I obviously struggle with. Um, oh, good. Perfect. So if we break open that spore, it actually heals us. So we're going to break up both of those. Oh, there's a jackal. I thought that was our monkey. The monkey might have died. Might have died. Okay, so our, hung or our health is back up. I think we might have lost the monkey. So we're gonna kill this rat. I'm kinda, I'll go in those doors. I just kinda wanna explore around first. There's a kobold. So let's kill the kobold, we got that. So far our battles are pretty easy, but they will get more complicated the further down we go, obviously. That's the whole point of Roguelike. There's another set of staircase. Oh, that must be the up staircase. These are the downward staircase, okay. Goblin Conjurers, let's see if we can sneak up on him. Standing. Okay, let's throw a yellow potion on him and see if it does anything. Uh, we need to get out of here. That gas will hurt us too. Oh, he can conjure these weapons, which is not good for us. Okay, uh, we need to kill him and all the weapons go away. Cool, so we discovered that the yellow potion, what the yellow potion does, so I believe the next time that we get a yellow potion, it will, it will already tell us what it does. So we can't go through there right now because we will hurt ourselves. That's why you want to be further back when you throw the stuff. So let's see what's in here. Rickety rope bridge. I wonder if there's a chance. A scarlet potion, which we do not know what it does yet. Let's go down here first. Just a rat. Rat scratches us, we defeat the rat. Nothing super exciting over here. See your rickety rope bridge. Doesn't seem to do anything, so I don't know that there's really a risk going over that. Um, here is another, yeah, our monkey definitely died because I wasn't paying attention. Actually, this room would be a good place to hang out while we, okay, we're healed. Now we should eat, oh, there's another goblin. Okay, so let's throw a scarlet potion and see what it does. Potion of descent, oh, nice. So he can't get to us. Neener, neener, neener. Well, while we're here, let's throw some of these other potions because we don't want to use them on ourselves without knowing what they do harmlessly. So that was Crimson Potion. I should be writing these down, I feel like. For sure, let's throw one more. Indigo. Harmlessly. Indigo is harmless. Scarlet is harmless. I believe that the red one was harmless. The only one that we know what it does is yellow. Yellow has been the only one that's been or no, yellow and the other one. Oh, the holes went away. So where'd this guy go? Because I kind of want to try to defeat him if we can. Okay, so let's throw 
See if a cy cyan potion does anything. Harmless. So these are ones that we want to try on ourselves later then. Because we know it's not going to hurt us. So they must do something good. Let's see if we can... Oops. Use... Or let's see if we can throw... And then a dart. Dart hits the goblin conjurer. Cool. He has 85 gold pieces. His health is low. Let's try an incendiary dart. I just want to see what these things do. So now he's burning and his health is low. Let's throw a dart again. And we killed him. Sweet. Sweetness. What's here? A wall mounted torch. Uh, I want to finish exploring this level and then I think we're going to call it an episode. I think I'm going to do shorter episodes for this series. Um, so about 15 minutes. And that's it. Ooh, a piece of food, which is good because we're going to have to eat soon. All right, guys, I think we're going to leave it here and we'll head down to the next level. We are in level three now, uh, I believe. Yep, depth three. Um, so we will head down to the next level. Ooh, a net trap. Let's kill this guy really fast. I know we're going to go over time right now, but why not? So that's a net trap. Cool. Um, so I do plan on playing more of these type of games on the channel. I really, really enjoy these games and I went down here even though I wasn't going to. Um, so thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and subscribe and we will see you next time on Rogue. Bye-bye.